AI news presenters take the world by storm. Hello wonderful people, I'm Janet Solomon. Welcome back to my channel. The future of news reporting has arrived, and it's powered by artificial intelligence. From major networks to independent channels, AI presenters are dominating the airwaves, delivering news with unparalleled precision and efficiency. But here's the best part. You can join the revolution without spending a dime. And the incredible editing capabilities of CapCut, you can create your very own AI news presenter and launch your own channel. In this groundbreaking video tutorial, I'll guide you through the process step by step. Unlocking the secrets to crafting compelling new segments with your AI presenter. From selecting the perfect voice to adding professional-grade visuals, you'll learn everything you need to know to captivate your audience and stand out in the digital landscape. Join the global community of eager learners who are reshaping the media landscape one video at a time. Subscribe to my channel now to support my efforts in creating more valuable content like this. Let's embark on this exciting journey together. No further ado, let's dive right in and unleash your potential. I'm sure you might be wondering how I did this, right? So make sure you stick around and watch this video to the end. And please don't forget to subscribe to my channel to encourage me. Now open your browser and look for this website, Pop AI. Select the first link you can see right here. The next thing you're going to see is this page. We are going to go ahead now and create an account with them. For me, I'm going to use my Google account. You can decide to use your email. That is totally okay. So click on continue with Google and this page will pop up. Select your Gmail and hit enter. Now, the only reason we are creating an account with this website is because of copyright. So in case you want to publish a content that is not your own, you can come to this website to rephrase it or you can also use chat GPT. Now, click on this upload file to upload your script or your documents. I'm going to teach you now how I did mine. So since mine is about news, I'm going to go back to Google now and you will type in punch newspaper and select this first link now from here i'm going to scroll down right now and i will just look for any tre trending topic i like um i think i'll just pick this first one for the sake of this video i'll pick this one select it and i will close this page scroll down and i'll just copy everything here copying it the next thing you are going to go to do now is to go and paste it either in your notepad but for me i'm going to open my microsoft word and paste it inside a new document so i will do my adjustment remove everything that needs to be removed So right now I'm done with all the adjustments. The next thing I want to do is to click on file and save it as choose the location where you want this file to be saved. Choose the folder and now I want to change the name. I'll just change it to breaking news. So once you are done with your naming, the next thing you're going to do is click on save and your document will be saved. Now go back to your browser to that first website we created accounts with them and click on upload file to upload this document. Remember where you saved it, breaking news, and you click OK. Right here, our document is loading. We'll wait for some minutes, I mean some seconds actually. After the upload, the AI is just going to rephrase all your scripts. You can see it right here. The script has been refreshed. So just select everything and copy it. Now, if you scroll down, you will see some questions under your script. These are the questions that you can throw to your audience to get them engaged. So once you are done with the copying, go back to your Microsoft Word and clean your old script. Paste this inside your document and save it. So go back to your browser and search for capcut.com. Now hit enter and this page is going to pop up. So when you hover over this create new, it's going to uh, bring a drop down box. Then you select 16.9, which is the YouTube format. And this page is going to open up. So the next thing we are going to do is to rename this project right here. Rename. And I will name it breaking news. So once you are done changing the name, the next thing we are going to do is to 
select element and right here in the search box we are going to search for news intro now hit enter the next thing is for you to wait for it to load and this is the effect click on view all and all the effects are going to be load like this so start checking for the one you like take your time to select the one you like so once you are done selecting your news intro the next thing you are going to do is to come here to this search bar and search for news background and you are going to pick any background you want i've done mine this is the background make sure you select similar backgrounds like your intro and your background are looking similar you can see my background has red and my intro too has red and blue so color balancing is very important when you are editing your video so right from this edge you are going to drag it to reduce the length of your intro so once you are done click on this play to preview your editing so far the next thing we are going to do is to add the character so right here just click on cancel to so cancel the intro that we searched now scroll down and you will see character here so click on view all now take your time to pick any one you like just take your time look check it to the bottom and see the character you like and select the one you want after picking the one you want just click on it and it's going to be added to your working space right here this is the character i want so click on the character and bring it to where the intro background is the next thing we are going to do is to work on our image now click on ai character and right here you can decide to choose half body it's going to be half i don't like this one so i'll go back to full body adjust the scale after adjusting the skill, the next thing is for us to add the script we created earlier, the punch um, news we created earlier. So right here is where we are going to add it. Have it in mind that you can only add 1000 words at a time. It can't be more than that. So I'll clean the default text. Now go to your Microsoft Word and copy some of, I'll copy some of the text and I'll go and paste it in that script area now if your sex is more than this there's no issue there's a way we can fix it which i'm going to show you towards the end of this video so bring the text and paste it here you can see that i have enough space again to paste i'll go back to my microsoft word and copy the remaining text and go back and paste it in that script area right now we are going to add voice to this um script so right here you just click on this drop down arrow then from this available options just play around with it and see the one that suits your channel or the voice that you are comfortable with or that matches what you want to say and pick any one you want from In there so for me i like this navigator voice effect so i will pick on it down now select apply to all and apply again so wait for a few seconds for the effects to be added right here you can see the effects has been added the next thing you are going to do is to click on this your intro background copy it and paste it so this way we are able to have the same length of background with our character so just duplicate it like that till you get the same length with your um, character so for color adjustments click on basic and start playing around with colors you can play around with hsl and just do anything that comes to your mind that you feel is okay actually now the next thing we are going to do is to add intro music so you click on this audio and on this search bar you search for news intro so right here we have tons of um intro audio so pick on any one and add it to your editing now this audio is too long we want to adjust it so click on it and click on split the split is going to split the audio and click on the one you the part you don't want and delete it now go back to this search bar and search for news background music now from this available option pick any one you like and add it to your project just like the same thing we did to the background the the music is not that long so you're just going to copy it and paste till it gets to the end of your project so make sure you reduce the volume of your background music so that it's not too loud 
more than what your character is saying or more than your content so once you are done click on this to remove that um box the next thing is for you to export your video now click on export and this page will pop up come down and click on download right here so change the resolution to 1 to 1080 and leave the video quality to the default one and export at the end of the day you should have something like this in this groundbreaking video tutorial i'll guide you through the process step by step join the global community of eager learners who are reshaping the media landscape one video at a subscribe to my channel now to support my efforts in creating more valuable content like this